Hey yarn friends, welcome back to Llama Mama Kayla's Yarn Tube. I appreciate you stopping by today. I'm happy to be visiting with you today. And I wanted to share with you guys that I finished my Vlogmas blanket. And if you don't recall, I will just tell you about this Vlogmas blanket. Uh, Terry at Yarn Joy Podcast and I did a swap for December where I sent her 25 baggies of scrap balls. And she sent me 25 baggies of scrap balls. And so we each made a rectangle granny blanket. And so we used the granny stitch and we made a rectangle blanket. And so each day we would open our scrap balls and add a, our color that we opened that day. And so it was a surprise of what color. <clears throat> and our blanket just grew all month long. It was such a fun project. I enjoyed it doing so, doing it so much. I want to do it again this next December, and I was thinking it would be really fun if um, my subscribers wanted to send a scrap ball, just a small scrap ball, anywhere from a half an ounce to an ounce. Um, but we'll wait and do that later in the year. Um, like in, we'll start that probably in October-ish. And so then I will make a blanket with scrap balls from my viewers. And so um, I'm going to propose that later. But anyway, I thought that would be fun because I definitely want to do that again. And it's just a fun project. And so I have finished my blanket. I, um, it is very scrappy and that's what I just so, so much love about it. And um, let me see. I think this is the front of it here so here it starts out and then you can see as it grows it gets scrappy faster and it just changes colors like it's all in there you know and I love that like I love the whole thing but my favorite parts are the scrappy scrappy parts and so you can see it's just changed colors and um, I put all of Terry's scrap balls in here that she sent me and then I put some of my own scrap balls and then Miss Curry if you're watching I put some of your mother's scrap balls in here too so um, it's a really cool blanket with you know scrap balls from different people and so I just love that and so I was thinking of Miss Curry because she's been a little bit sick so I was thinking of her while I was adding my scrap uh, the scrap balls from her mother so, um, anyway, I love this blanket. I love how it's turned out. So here's how wide it is. Yeah. Here's how wide it is. You can't really see, <laughs> but that is the long way wide. So yes, it does cover up a large person very well. <laughs> and that's what I wanted to do. And then let's see if I can show you how long it is. And, um, It's pretty long. I mean, it, it's be a great snuggly blanket. So I kept going around and adding to the blanket. I wanted to get it a good size to put on the back of the love seat in the den. That's Jody's hangout room. And so sometimes um, me or the boys, one of, you know, we don't usually all sit in there together, but somebody will go in there and watch a movie with him or talk to him or something or, you know. And so I just thought I'd put this blanket there on the um, love seat, and that way, um, you know, anybody goes and sits on it, they'll have a little blanket if they get cool or chilly and can grab this blanket and cover it with. So I love how the blanket turned out. It's probably one of my favorite blankets, <laughs> just because um, it's pretty. It's pretty. It's pretty. It really is pretty. And the yarn. Okay, here we go. Um, <laughs> The yarn is special to me because it came from Terry, and Terry is special to me. And then also that I put um, some of Miss Curry's mother's scrap balls in here, and um, then some of my own scrap balls. <laughs> and so as I was putting, you know, different things, I was of my scrap balls. I was thinking of projects that I made with that yarn. So. Anyway, I think it just turned out cool. If you haven't made a scrap blanket um, and you've been thinking about it, um, I would go ahead and do it because um, it's just beautiful. And I had been wanting to make a scrap blanket for a while. 
And it's just one of those projects, you know, like, yes, I want to make that. And then I uh, never was, gonna, you know, getting around to making it. And then um, when Terry said, hey, let's do a yarn ball swap and make scrap, scrappy blankets. I was like, yes, I've been wanting to do that. And now I'll have a reason to do it. <laughs> I won't have an excuse not to do it. So anyway, yep, I love it. And um, anyway, it was a fun project. And like I said, I want to do that again this next December. And I would love to put scrap balls in it from my viewers. I love my yarny friends. And it would be just fun to put balls in from you guys. So I will let you get going. And I will talk to you all again very soon. I just wanted to share this blanket with y'all. Bye, guys.